show at 54 Below, October 1st and October 8th, entitled Be Mused, which is sort of a wordplay for the idea about the musical spark that would happen between a singer when the right singer meets the right songwriter or the right songwriting team. Paris. When you think of the great songwriting singer teams in history, it would be like Dionne Warwick and Hal David and Bert Bacharach. It would be like Astro Gilberto and Jobim, who brought, you know, the sound of Brazil to the world. It would be Fred Astaire and Jerome Kern. Today I sang was the combination of Piaf and a guy named Louis Guy. This song was initially shelved by Piaf. She wrote, penned the lyric, but her friends didn't think it was very strong material for her, so she put it away for a year. But I guess because she wrote it and she had a strong will, she decided, no, this is a good tune. Screw you, I'm going to sing it anyway. And she sang La Vie en Rose and became an international star. So there's kind of fun stories behind each one of these songs. And when you kind of know where the song has come from, when you actually hear the song, it gives it just a little more energy and dimension, you know what I mean? Which is what I like. I like when this setup to a number takes you a little deeper into the song. So I'm hoping that's what happens in Bemused. a web of muses, you know. I'm married to a composer, Marty Silvestri. When I heard him play, when you hear somebody play, it moves you to a place you would not necessarily go on your own. That's a magical moment, you know, that's a musical event to me. Merci mille fois.